Ford Priorities. As you can see, it's a beautiful day out. We are going to talk today about how to use the autopilot, how to correctly engage it, disengage it, and use it. Um, first thing we want to do is make sure that we're a safe distance from the shore. Safe distance. We want to make sure there's no other boats around or anything else that's going to require us to immediately take control of the wheel. Uh, once we're at a safe distance, we're going to go ahead then and uh, start the engagement process by locking the clutch mechanism on the wheel. And to do that, you're going to come around the wheel and you're going to lock the clutch all the way in. You don't have to force it, but it will lock and snap right into place. Uh, once we're sure that that's locked in, we're going the right, we're on a steady course going forward. We're going to then go ahead and press the auto button. This will engage the motor. And that will then take over, uh, basically take over the wheel. Uh, so again, we want to make sure we're at a safe distance from any other boats, from shore and any other hazards. Uh, now we can go ahead and actually steer the boat a little bit from the autopilot. So to do that, we can take small steps using minus one or plus one degree, or we can take larger steps doing minus ten or plus ten degrees. This will swing the boat. It's actually pretty accurate. Um, let's see here. Another thing we want to make absolutely certain before we start any of this is that the wheel is completely unlocked. It should always be unlocked before we take the boat out of the dock. That's an absolute must. Um, so now we've got the boat under autopilot. As you can see, I'm not touching the wheel. It's handling it for me. Let's talk about how we turn the, the autopilot system off. And if we very quickly needed to take control of the boat, uh, the first thing that we would do is turn off the motor system. So we would go from auto, where it is now, to standby. So this stops moving the motor. Next thing we want to do is very quickly disengage the clutch. Once it's all the way up, the boat's back under our control. And that's, uh, that's basically it.